Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Titin and in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how I do my go-to everyday makeup look. So first off, I'm gonna spray myself with this MAC Prep and Prime setting spray to hydrate my skin. Also, I will list down all the products that I use today as always in my description box down below. Next, I'm gonna go in with my primer and for my primer today, I'll be using this professional hydrating primer by benefit I'm gonna squeeze about a pea size on my fingers and focus mainly on my cheek area where I have larger and visible pores and rest I'm gonna distribute evenly on my face and blend out with my fingers Next, I'm gonna take this Luminator from Iconic London to give me that glow from within look and I'm gonna apply directly on my face and blend it out with my fingers. Next up, I'm gonna color correct my skin. Usually I skip this step but as you can see, my skin is not doing well. I have a lot of bumps and acne and also some dark spots from my previous acne. So I'm gonna be concealing that today. So for my concealer, I'll be using this Becca's Brightening Concealer. It has like a salmon undertone which helps to cover up the darkness. So I'm gonna apply underneath my eyes and wherever it's needed. So next I'm gonna take this green color character from Revlon. Uh, the green helps to cover up the redness so I'll be covering up my red spots and all the redness that I have in my face. I'm gonna take this beauty sponge to blend out everything. Next, I'm gonna go in with the foundation and for my foundation today, I'll be using this Light Wander in shade 8 medium from Charlotte Tilbury and Pretty Fresh Foundation by Colourpop in shade medium 80W. I'll be mixing both of these foundation because the Charlotte Tilbury is darker and the Pretty Fish is lighter so for my perfect uh, shade I'll be mixing both of these two foundation. And to apply my foundation I'll be using my beauty sponge and my fingers. Next, I'm gonna go in with my concealer and for my concealer today, I'll be using my trusty Age Rewind Concealer by Maybelline in shade medium. For my powder today, I'll be using this Clean Fresh Powder by CoverGirl in shade light. I'm just gonna apply with this big fluffy powder brush. So for my bronzer, I'm gonna go in with this Hula Bronzer by Benefit and I'm gonna apply with the fluffier pointed brush. Mm -hmm. 
Next up, I'm going to do my brows and for my brows today, I'll be using this brow pencil from L'Oreal Paris. I really like this pencil because it's really tiny and it's like easy to draw that faux feathery brows that gives you natural look to the brows. Next, I'm going to take this brow powder by Tonia Crook and I'm going to use the darkest shade from the palette and I'm going to apply on top of the brow pencil to set my brows. For my highlighter today, I'll be using this travel size highlighter from Jouer in shade Topaz. I'm gonna take my fan brush to apply my highlighter to give me that everyday natural glow and I'm gonna apply on the high points of my cheeks, nose, forehead, cupid's bow and my chin. For my blush, I'm using this ColourPop blush in shade between the sheets and I'm gonna apply with my blush brush. So I'm going to curl my lashes and for my mascara today, I'll be using the Waterproof Sky High Mascara from Maybelline. For my lips, I'll be using this MAC times Pony collaboration. I'll apply a little bit and I'm just gonna blend it out with my finger for the natural finish. I'm gonna add this Kendall and Kylie collaboration gloss from Kylie Cosmetics to finish up my look. Lastly, I'm gonna go in with this All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray which will help my makeup last longer. So that's pretty much it for my go-to everyday makeup look. I hope you guys liked this video as much as I enjoy creating this look. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so by hitting that subscribe down below. And until next time, take care. Bye.